Hey guys, welcome back to another Z Code System video. And this week, we're once again talking about the elite European soccer games going on this coming weekend, May 11th and 12th. Now, guys, it's a bit of a sad week around the Z Code System offices as the English Premier League will be coming to an end on Sunday, May the 12th. And we're going to be having some big games because the Premier League title will be decided on the final day of the season. Now, if you're like me, you love to be able to see this kind of great action and to wager on it at the end of the season where everything is still to play for, which uh, which doesn't often happen uh, or doesn't happen every year in the English Premier League. Now, of course, you can go over to the Z Code System Sports Predictions and Picks blog and check out all the great articles there. And there is my latest blog on these games, and we're going to cover two from the Premier League this week. And you can also go there and read the blog to check out some other predictions we've made for the English Championship playoff games that are going on. But we're not going to talk about those, so you're going to have to go over there and read the blog to check those out. But let's get on to those English Premier League games for the final day of the season. So as you can see here, I have the VIP club and the VIP wall already up and ready to go. And here is the Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Liverpool at Liverpool's Anfield Stadium. That's going to happen simultaneously as Manchester City and Brighton kick off in Brighton at the Amex Stadium. Now, of course, Liverpool are one point behind Manchester City going into the weekend. They must win and Manchester City must either lose or draw with Brighton to give the Reds the title for the first time in 29 years. Now, as you can see, Liverpool and Wolves both go into this game very much red hot. Uh, Wolverhampton Wanderers can still qualify for the Europa League, but they will need some help uh, with the FA Cup that's coming up on May 18th. Liverpool, they will be insured Champions League football for next season with their top four finish. Now, if you were watching this week with the Champions League, Liverpool came back behind. Liverpool came back from being down 3-0 to Barcelona to overtake them 4-3 in the semifinals of the Champions League. And they have qualified for the final in Madrid coming up in June, June 1st, that is. And they will either play Ajax or Tottenham. Of course, we are recording that just hours before kickoff of that semifinal game. So Liverpool and Wolves taking on each other. Liverpool did defeat Wolves earlier this season back uh, in December, right before Christmas. And let's just take a real quick look at the head-to-head -head between these two teams. And that comes up, as you can see, Liverpool with a 2-0 win over Wolverhampton Wanderers. Mohamed Salah picked up a goal in that game, as well as Virgil van Dijk. Now, the big news uh, on the injury front for, for Liverpool is Mohamed Salah, who suffered a concussion uh, in their last Premier League game against Newcastle. That was a 3-2 win for the Reds. He missed the midweek game against Barcelona. Not sure if he's going to be playing just yet uh, due to that concussion. Also, striker Roberto Firmino did sit out the midweek game against Barcelona. He has a slight groin injury. Uh, there's word that it could be a groin tear. They're a bit silent on um, the overall um, extent of that injury right now. But, you know, uh, I'm going to go ahead and admit I'm a Liverpool supporter and um, I hope they win over the weekend. And I'm predicting another win over Wolves. Wolves. Don't really have much to play for except for pride here. They're going to finish in seventh place at the weekend, so um, they're not going to be falling out of that. They can't go up. They can't go down. Liverpool have everything to, to play for, um, and they must hope that Manchester City lose or draw against Brighton, which who knows if that will happen at the moment. But I'm predicting a tight, tight game here. Liverpool picking up the win, as you can see here. Z-Code predict, has predicted a 1-0 win to Liverpool, and I like that pick. And uh, I'm going to back that for Sunday's game at Anfield. So as you can see here, I've got my drop down box. So I'm going to go to the Manchester City Brighton game. And we've clicked on that. And we've brought that up there. And as you can see, burning hot Manchester City and Brighton, <laughs> not so burning hot. Uh, they're a bit average. Uh, they've just secured their status for next season in the English Premier League. So they'll be back next year uh, just um, beating out uh, Cardiff City for that. Uh, and they were they will finish in uh, 17th place at the end of the season. Manchester City, like I said, burning hot. But over the last six games, 
they haven't been scoring the goals that they were earlier on this year. Earlier this year, we were seeing these massive four or five nil score lines uh, that they were doing, but it's been a bit nervy uh, as of late. They, uh, they've had that pressure on them to get these wins. Um, last uh, Monday night, they defeated Leicester City 1-0 thanks to a wonder strike from Vincent Company, a goal no one saw coming. And, um, you know, it's goals like that uh, that come out of nowhere to win you Premier League titles. So Manchester City charging on. So um, looking very quickly at uh, the head-to-head between these two teams, of course, uh, Manchester City did beat Brighton back in April in the FA Cup semifinals. Um a one nil that game not actually on our um, uh, our head to head here, but we do see Manchester City's previous win from earlier this year at the Itahad two nil, uh, picking up that victory in September. Now, as I said, Brighton have not been that great uh, lately. And as we scroll back up, we can look at uh, some of their games there. Uh, they did pick up a one one draw at Arsenal. Um, last weekend, but Manchester City, a much more difficult team that they will be playing and uh, a team that you would think are going to pull out the victory and win the title on the last day of the season. My uh, my hope is they won't, but my gut feeling is Manchester City will edge this victory. I think it's going to be a very tight game, much like Manchester City's recent games are going to grind out a victory and uh, beat Brighton by that 1-0 scoreline that is being predicted by our Z code predictions here. So guys, um, these two games, a Manchester City win and a Liverpool win, but Manchester City picking up the title. That's my prediction for the weekend. Now, if you go back to last week with our Z code predictions for the football games, the elite soccer games going on in Europe, you can see that we were two for three in our picks. So Guys, go over to our blog, check out the four games we have there. We've talked about two of them already, but uh, we have two games for the weekend in the championship. The playoffs going on, Aston Villa taking on West Brom and Derby County taking on Leeds United. Two massive games and with uh, big money implications if one of those two teams, or sorry, if one of those teams can make it to the Premier League. So guys, good luck with your betting this week. Enjoy the last day of the English Premier League season. I'm going to be loving it. And uh, I'll be loving it even more if Liverpool can pull off a victory. Enjoy the weekend, and we'll see you next time at Z-Code System.